when you use the dispersant, what that does is you're making a choice. You're keeping the oil off the beaches and maybe out of the public eye, but you're putting the oil into the parts of the water column, into the parts of the Gulf of Mexico, where there are more creatures living. So we're taking it out of places where it's more visible, but unfortunately it's going into places where there's more life and it has a bigger impact on the life in the Gulf. What we're doing at Worcester Polytechnic Institute is looking at how the dispersant, when it's mixed with the oil in seawater, changes the toxicity of that crude oil. If you just put the crude oil on the surface, most of the water doesn't pick up a lot of the very persistent toxins that crude oil has as a, a normal component. When you add the dispersant, what happens is instead of floating on the surface, those more toxic materials that are bound up inside the crude oil, they get released into the water. We're finding that when you add even a tiny amount of dispersant to a crude oil slick in the laboratory, you increase the most toxic chemicals that are actually in the water by a factor of about 35 times. Those toxic materials are usually bound up in the oil where they can be skimmed and removed. But once you add even a small amount of that dispersant, all that material starts to move down into the water where the creatures that live in it can be exposed.